welcome to this week's edition of The Scots in Us, when we turn our thoughts to holiday gift giving. We're going to join with several of our partners to hear what they have to offer in time for Christmas to bring a little bit of Scotland to you here in the United States or back home to your friends and family. We're going to begin by speaking to Emily at the Scotland shop. And so let's travel up to Scotland and begin our journey. And now I'm delighted that we're going to catch up with Scotland Shop and hear from them about all their wonderful ideas for what you still can get into the United States in time for the holidays. So hello, Scotland Shop. Hello, Emily. How are you today? I'm great. Thank you, Camilla. Thanks for inviting me to join you from sunny Scotland. Well, it's getting cooler here. Christmas is definitely coming. And so this is our program where we're asking some of our favorite uh, partners to tell us what they suggest is, is the great Christmas gift that we can still get. And in your case, every, there's a lot of custom, but you yes. also have this wonderful range of tartan items that one can get. But before we get to that, could you give us a sort of brief recap as to the past 10 years that has suddenly taken you to not suddenly taken you, but has resulted in you now being such a great one shop stop for all this stuff. Yeah, so um, we were first founded in 2002 um, here in the southeast of Scotland, so a very rural setting, um, and we're online only up until 2017 when we opened our first bricks and mortar store in the West End of Edinburgh. Um, and that was really due to popular demand by customers wanting to come and see those products in person, get a feel for them, help with measurements and discovering their own clan tartans. Um, and then following that, we first came out to New York in 2019 to take part in, in New York City Tartan Week, which of course is always a, a highlight of the Scottish calendar in the state. <laughs> Um, and we had such a good time there and, and met so many connections um, that then that led us um, earlier this year, so in March, um, to open our store upstate um, New York, so Albany, New York, is where we settled on as our, our American home. Um, and yeah, yeah we've, we've just been taking it from there, lots of Scottish festivals and uh, other pop-up stores um, in and around the Northeast region. I think the wonderful thing that you have is, yes, you do made to measure with the kilts and the trues and the wonderful jackets, but you then have this great range of other items that we can enjoy, whether we're wearing our own tartan or suddenly decide we really need a bag or a tote in a green tartan today or a pink tartan. And so you do have these wonderful extra items. So as we come up to the holidays and it's a bit late for getting the new outfit for the holidays probably made to measure though they can still do that for burns night um <laughs> we <laughs> we could you tell us a few sort of items that you suggest around sort of the bags and the different things and different price points yeah absolutely so like you say for some of those larger custom-made items We'd, we'd be pushing it for Christmas now, but there's still some great gift options, um, great accessories. So maybe for the, the man in your life, then you would maybe be looking at a tie or bow tie. So we can do free tied and self tied. So don't worry if you can't tie your own bow tie, we can, we can still help. Um, and so, yeah, if we're making them to order, there are over 500 different tartans to choose from. Um, and we do try to keep a, a wide variety of the clan tartans in stock and ties, as we know that they are always popular gifts too. And um, you also have some ornaments, if I'm not mistaken, that yeah. I saw online. And I thought those would be a great, you know, gift for anybody who was looking for that holiday favour. Absolutely, yeah. So again, we have a, a variety of ornaments. And um, one of our most popular ones is um, called our Scottish Tartan Heart. So I'll bring one up on screen here. Um, so you can choose your tartan there and it's got some Hessian and hand stitching um, to finish that off. So this one is the newly designed Albany Tartan that we 
be made in celebration of, of our new American home. But again, you can choose your own plan tartan or we have a, a range in stock. Um, to and how choose. much will that, um, about how much is that? Because yeah, I so, thought it was quite reasonable. Oh, thank you. Yeah, so depending on whether you're going for a stock or custom item, you're probably looking sort of between 15 and $20 for, for one of those. That's great. And they and they would be able to get these by Christmas. Yes. Yeah. So, yeah, smaller items like that. We've got a, a team of local seamstresses that are, are busily stitching away to, to get everyone these items in time for Christmas. Um, and what are your new tote bags and different things that you have? Those look really fun. Yeah, so again, we you know we talked about um, accessories for gentlemen, but we we do have a range of bags for ladies. So we can make fully tartan uh, tote bags, um, clutch bags, evening bags. So again, there's a there's a large range of styles. Um, you would just have to watch when you go onto each of those products to to double check on the custom makeup times. But again, for each of those, we do have some in stock. And just so that we um. Uh, mention a few other things yeah. I um, if you're thinking about Burns Night which comes so quickly after the holidays and oh. you're thinking about what should I get somebody for Christmas but you know and I don't have to have it under the tree it could just be a card or a certificate under the tree um, I love your shoes oh, I think yeah. those are fabulous tartan shoes how yeah. different and unique I know, yeah. I mean, it's. I think it was um, sort of early two thousand and tens that we first introduced the tartan shoes, and they've they've been one of our most popular products since. They always stand out whenever we come to events. Um, so we've got unisex trainers, which are very comfortable. I love running about at events in, in those. Um, and then we also have um boots and heeled shoes for ladies, and then brogues for men so if they want to include some tartan to match their kilt into their kilt shoes then it's a really special sort of finishing touch for the perfect kilt outfit and you do have some throws as well um which i think are always a great gift that's a you know, fantastic piece and you do of course if you've got to do like i do gifts back to the family yeah. who are still back over the other side of the Atlantic, you can, we, you can ship for us. Yeah, absolutely. So we can ship worldwide. So it doesn't have to come directly to you. We can do um, shipments to any other country for you. And we can even do some gift wrapping. So we've become experts in that over the year. Um, so yeah, any gift messages you want to include, just let us know in the notes on your order and we can get that all organised too. Well, I think this is wonderful, and I'm so looking forward to seeing you in the coming weeks as you return back to the United States. I've got to make my way up to the Albany store, but you're going to be down here for Tartan Week again, I hope, in New York, aren't you? Yeah, absolutely, yeah. We're very much looking forward to the return of Tartan Week, the 25th anniversary, so I'm sure it'll be a big celebration. I know. And so thank you so much, Emily. A very happy holidays to you and to everybody there. And thank you for all you're doing for all of us. Thank you also. Look forward to seeing you soon. Bye. And so thank you to Emily for sharing with us those wonderful Scotland shop gift ideas. And now we turn to the Scottish grocer. The Scottish grocer is a leading importer of Scottish foodstuffs. And in their section, gift giving, you will find some wonderful packages of foods, stuffs, from fudges to teas to coffees to um, lemon curds to Christmas puddings in great jute bags or now their latest tartan tweeds that they are doing. So go to the scottishgrocer.com click on gift ideas and you will find some wonderful things that they are offering. The Scottish Grocer is also a partner of the ASF and if you are a member please remember to use your discount code and to click on it um, at, on the page when you do your order. This will give you a 20% discount. If you've lost your code just send us an email. 
but there are wonderful gift ideas for you there from $125 right the way up to $250 or just to buy the individual products. And now let us journey across to Connecticut, where we will join with Hilary Crichton of Scottish Creations, who have a wonderful gift giving business that has come together from her love and passion for the small designers and entrepreneurs of Scotland. Everything from jewelry to fashion, across to men's gifts. She's going to find us something unique for the holidays. And so let's join Hillary Crichton. And now I'm delighted that we're going to be joining Hillary from Scottish Creations, one of our favorite um, partners who we do so many things with. Hillary began her company just a few years ago, but it's about Scotland. It's about wonderful, unique designers that she sources. And in everything you do, and we see on her website, you can feel her passion and her love for everything she's bringing to us. And so, Hilary, good afternoon. Hello, Camilla. Good afternoon to you. It's lovely to be here. Thank you for having me. Well, how could we not be talking to you as we approach Christmas and the holiday gifting? Because Scottish Creations really now gives us a place to go to for those holiday Scottish gifts whether we want to send something here or have something for our families back over in the in the UK, it's because you can do it all. Yes, we can now, we can now. And the Scottish Creations has really been set up especially for that, you know, to try and bring a little bit of contemporary Scotland over to North America. Yes. Some of the lovely things that you see there that are made by individuals and families, you know, we have a grandmother and a granddaughter team um family business you know the cardigan behind us is a family business actually based in edinburgh in the grass market in edinburgh so it is 100 percent scottish and made in the grass market so we try to bring these over to um help people with the gift choosing exactly as you say to bring a bit of scotland here or to send a little bit somewhere else well i love um how you have things for the lads and things for the lasses and <laughs> Um, also, then these wonderful designers that you find um, that really um, it always amazes me how you're finding new new piece, new jewelry designers and textile designers. So why don't we begin? Um, everything you're going to talk about, people can get as long as they get on with it um, in time <laughs> for Christmas. So um, let's start with the with the with the gentleman. With the gentleman. Okay, well, to follow on with your theme of whiskey and all the interesting people you've got speaking to you, I've, I've got some whiskey things that I would like to show you. So I'm going to bring these forward because I'm not sure you can see so terribly well. So this is a whiskey set. It's a tasting set. As you can Ooh. see, you have your little mini Glen Cairn here, and it's all set on one of the old whiskey staves from the barrel. Made by a company called Angel Share Glass, based in Bridge of Allen, in just outside of Stirling. And it, it's a father and daughter team that do this. And the father is a master glass blower. And I know that this is a, a, a trade that is sadly diminishing, disappearing, but he keeps it going. And these droppers have all been hand blown by him. So here, just to give you an idea, is the dropper and the idea and i'm sure that the whiskey gentlemen will follow up on this they do say the whiskey producers that one drop of water you need one drop of water and one drop only to allow this chemical reaction to occur in the whiskey and then you get the best flavor ever so this company have uh, started as father and daughter these water droppers so it basically works like a, a chemistry pipette think back to school yeah. days has a little you know you put so you pop it in the water put your finger over the hole and it holds the water in here and then you release it one drop at a time and this one has the thistle so you can even choose what you want to be on the top this one has the thistle we also have the angel oh. and she is so important because you know the angel still gets her share of whiskey and this company has cleverly this this father and daughter cleverly come up with the idea of angel share 
um, after the angels pinching her share back in the day when they didn't really know what happened to the bit that went missing. But now, of course, we do know, but we Scots still like to think that the angels have got their share. So she's on there specifically for the angel share. And uh, we also have Nessie. <laughs> we love Nessie. So he comes in, or she comes, depending, in blue and purple and green at the top. And then the final one we have is the pot still, which is what the whiskey is actually distilled in. And so this is all hand blown in Bridge of Allen. And it's just so cool. So you get the four different designs on the top. You get to choose which one you want. But they're also very reasonably priced and they're beautifully boxed, if yes. I remember right. Yes, they come in at, I think it's uh, 44 95 Sorry, I should have, they, yeah. And they come in a lovely box, which I haven't got here to show you, but they do no, come but... in a lovely box. Now, yeah. this, this one here is called a pocket dropper. So this is for the whiskey, the guy that wants to go out to his whiskey tasting and pop his dropper in his pocket and it's put inside this lovely Harris Tweed holder which completely protects the dropper in there, close it up in your pocket and you're all set to go. It's 100% Harris Tweed and it comes in the blue and in a mustardy shade. Um, it comes in the herringbone and it also comes in a McLeod, which I'm waiting on more coming in. They should be arriving tomorrow. So, but you know, so they don't need to have a pocket square anymore. They now, the cool thing to do is to have their dropper in there. Have their dropper handy. <laughs> so these droppers are slightly smaller than these droppers, as you can see, purely for putting it in your pocket. So this one here is to carry about with you. And this one really is more for home, for a display or as you say it comes in a lovely gift and, and they're just so nice but these ones are a little bit smaller but they do fit right inside these just pop them in there and you're good to go all ready for your whiskey and the tasting uh plank excuse my wrong naming of it is a great gift and this is the you other one so we have we, we do have the two different types so this one has the larger Glencairn. So this is a proper whiskey glass, the Glencairn. The, we, we Scots call it the Glencairn, and I think it's pretty well known across the world as a Glencairn. So this is your full glass with your, your dropper. And again, you can choose what you want on the top of this for your set. And these, as I say, the old whiskey staves. So they're, Lovely. it's a fabulous idea. So the, the, this is the, the proper whiskey glass, and this one is the tasting glass. So you can see it's a little bit smaller. Fabulous. It's a taster to give you a wee, just a, just a wee nip, as we would say. Now we've, done, now, we've taken care of the lads. Now, taking the lasses and making sure our ladies are taken care of. You always have some wonderful jewellery. Shall we start with that? Sure. So yes, I've, I've pulled out a few little pieces of jewellery here, which I love from Sheila Fleet. And I've also pulled some out from Cath Waters and they're both very different. So this is Sheila Fleet and all her jewellery, again, a family run business based in Orkney. Every piece is handmade in Orkney. So again, fully Scottish through and through. And she takes all her inspiration from what she sees around about her. And these, this one here is called flagstones after all the flagstones that are around and about in Orkney. And, you know, they're just beautiful, beautiful pieces. This one is called Arctic Stream. So in the springtime when the ice is melting. And that really lovely. looks wonderful work. Now, is that, uh, what method? is that this is silver and she uses enamel to bring the blue color in but she does do some that are just silver completely silver on their own for example this is our thistle which is really lovely and again it's solid silver and the difference between this and your ordinary there's no silver plate here and you know with silver plated jewelry for us ladies we're constantly having to shine it up because it gets tarnished this you will not need to do nearly so often because it's solid and it's really excellent quality. It's beautiful. And you won't have any reaction. You should have it. any reaction because it is. Wear sterling, fully, you're absolutely fine wearing it. Should, it, it. It should be fully okay. 
And this is kind of a cool piece that she does modeled on the moon. She calls this lunar. And this particular one has a little pearl in the center because sometimes the moon looks, looks like it's, as my daughter once said, the moon's got his lights on. Uh -huh. so this, this one here looks like the moon has got his lights on. And it's a really pe pretty piece. You know, the, the younger girls quite like these ones. They're a little bit smaller. Yeah. Um, some of us more mature ladies prefer a little bit of a bigger piece. And this is one example of one that she does. This is called Sea and Surf. And around Orkney, the seas are crazy, crazy wild. So this is the, to represent the waves and you know the crashing of the waves coming. And, and then you had that wonderful jacket behind you, which I saw when I was up in New Hampshire. And, and just wonderful. Can you tell us a little bit about that? It's absolutely beautiful. Again, made in um, Edinburgh in the grass market, family run business. It's lovely. This is just a little pin that I put on it that is also made in Scotland, but that you can use to hold it together should you want to. You don't have to, so you can have it hanging open, but you know, it's all different inside. And as it, as it moves about, as you move, the piece will move and you get to see all the different colors in it. It's soft, it's wonderful. It's, um, uh, there's a bit of Irish linen in there also to keep it, just to give it that extra nice feel. It doesn't feel like an ordinary knitted jumper. It's and, pretty. And it feels yeah. like it's got some room to move. So you don't have to worry about the fit so much. Absolutely. This is what I would call a little bolero jacket. So it really sits on me. And I think I'm kind of average. It sits just about where my um, skirts would, with the waistband around right. your waist. And it is really nice and loose. You know, it's it's not a heavy thing at all. It's it's almost like a cut sweater, you know. So well, we love nice. to uh, layer. So this is great for that. You Perfect know, for that. something underneath. Yeah. Have that on to dress you up a bit. Yes. And that is available now. These are all available now. And I have other ones that have uh, more of a graduated hem. So they're slightly longer at the back and they have a little bit more here. But again, you can clip them up this way or just hold them together in the middle. You can do so many different things with them with the, with the colors that they're bringing in. So it's not just one color. As you can see, this is basically purple, but it's purple with a touch of navy blue through it. So you're getting a really nice, a really nice mix. And you've also, I don't know if you have them with you right now, but you also have soaps and um, lots of other fragrances and um, some tea towels and things for the kitchen. And there's so many things on your website. We do, we do. We have tea towels. And this is our healing coup. Oh my gosh. And we have, that. this is the pillow. Um, we call them cushions in Scotland, but we call them pillows here. This is the pillow, but we do have aprons and tea towels that are just like that. And then I brought some of these over for you to have a look at. These are, they're just little key rings, little pick me up things, but they're also Highland cows. And we have aprons that have one of these Highland cows on the um, apron. So you can, they come in all sorts of different colors. Oh, they're really kind of cute, you know. So these come on the apron. So if you're looking for one of these, they have a, it's actually a pin that you get on the apron and on the um, tea towel, which is kind of cute. Well, so there's lots of different things because as we were saying to um, earlier, it's nice to be able to give that little favor when you turn up you to and pop in on people over the holidays. And so little things like that, Yes. And just give them a touch of Scotland that they might not otherwise have. Absolutely, absolutely. And this is another nice little thing. I should have shown you this with the whiskey. This is a Christmas tree decoration. And this is the angel again for the angel share. Like well, that's for everyone. That's for not, everyone. That's gorgeous. If you're going to meet somebody or visit. It's always a nice little thing to take along. And the, the angel's holding the pot still, which is what the whiskey, of course, is distilled in. And it's now you're offering a wonderful bonus, and we've got two bonuses actually. If you are a member of the American Scottish Foundation, you also can take advantage of our code ASF2020 for a 10% discount. We love that. 
Um, yes. And we're so grateful to you also for all you do for us. But then you're also offering free shipping. We also, yes, we're doing free shipping completely across all products until the 14th of December. Um, I wouldn't risk it after that. I think really you need to be looking at priority after that. But up to the 14th of December across every product, it's free shipping. And we also will be very happy to wrap your gift for you. If you want us to send it directly to the person that, who it's for, we will do that. If you don't think you're going to be able to see them. Or if you want to send something off to somebody, we'll wrap it and we'll write a tag. All we ask is that you let us know what you want us to write in the tag. Well, thank you so much for everything, Hilary. Thank you for all you do to uh, bring Scotland to us and to make it so easy for us to share our love of Scotland and the gifts and ideas of these um, are often very small suppliers um, yes. you know something really unique and special that you bring to us so a happy holiday to you and, and you. speaking to you shortly okay and thank you very much it's been an absolute pleasure thank you Camilla thank you Bye. thank you Hilary for those great gift ideas on the American Scottish Foundation Facebook shop page you will also find some gift ideas from us the gift of membership, our Highland coups with their tart and bow ties, to our mugs, and also a direct link to our Scottish Morn and Scottish Afternoon Harney's Tea Programme. A great way to support us and also find a great gift from us to you. And now we turn to Robin Robinson for he, all his ideas around whiskey. And so I'm delighted this afternoon that we're going to be joined by Robin Robinson, who's a whiskey aficionado and ambassador and all things about whiskey we could possibly want to know and helps us at the ASF in many ways um, at our various events with wonderful whiskey tastings. And so good afternoon, Robin. Thank you for joining us. As we oh, look it's my at, pleasure. As we look at the holidays and Christmas, because you have a book that is a complete whiskey course, which I think is the most wonderful gift for the lover of whiskey or just as a compedium at the house that you buy yourself as a treat as you've done and bought everybody else a present. So can you tell us how all this began? Well, I sure can. Here, let me get the uh, the book. The book's right back here. Oh, there you've got one too. So everyone's got a copy and... Uh... So the first thing to know is that it is very heavy. It's three pounds. Um, if you drop it on your foot, it will hurt. So uh, it's a it's a hardback cover book, so it looks great on your coffee table as well. So um, it just so happens uh, that I, um, pre-pandemic, I taught the longest running whiskey course in the United States that ran for 11 years uh, up until the uh, pandemic shutdown of March 2020. And last night, I'm happy to announce that it has come off the mat, so to speak. And uh, uh, we sold out um, our first class in three years um, uh, last night. Um, and so we're uh, kicking off a complete schedule starting in January. Well, about five years ago, actually, it's about five years ago um, uh, last month. One of my students came up to me, I uh, introduced himself as an editor with a publishing house, and that they had published uh, quite a few of very well-known books in the wine and spirits industry, of which I knew th the books uh, and, uh, and or knew the authors of them. And so it was very impressive, and they were asking whether or not I'd be interested in writing a sort of a comprehensive and authoritative book about whiskey that would be similar to the class that I had taught there. And I said, sure. And uh, yeah, there's a, a great. Um, it's beautiful. Yeah, and, and there's a. Print, you know, I, I, just to say that it is a beautiful printing. It is yeah, gorgeous. I'm really pleased with it. So from what I see, we we go, we can look at American whiskeys in a, in a chapter, in a course. Yes. Then we yeah. can go to the craft whiskeys. Right, they get I their own. They they got their own. Uh, they got their own course. Yeah, because there was so so much of them. And and also, 
as we've been discussing, you know, we've really been enjoying doing these whiskey uh, podcasts as well. And yeah. um, really around the new distilleries coming out of Scotland. There yeah. are so many wonderful new um, distilleries coming together that are just beginning to come over here. Is it, it seems quite complicated for the Scots whiskey or gins to be imported into the United States. We we'll have to talk about that a little bit further on our next whiskey uh, dis whiskey episode in March. Yeah. But for right now, we've got Christmas four weeks away. Yeah. So they can get this really fabulous book. And we have some copies here at the ASF that are ready to be shipped out directly to you. Um, we um, have it available through our shop on Facebook. Um, it's $35. And I think it's a fabulous gift. Um, also, the the courses we um, the, are down at Asta, where, what is How would they find out about the courses in Lower Manhattan? So they can go up online uh, and it's uh, Center nyc.com so it's a-s-t-o-r all right and, so those, at, and those are once a month around a theme yes so we uh last night um we uh we re-inaugurated um the whiskey smackdown scotch versus bourbon um what we've got coming up is uh irish versus japanese <laughs> um uh the world whiskey apocalypse and uh then we got the craft whiskey roundup coming up as well so there's six whiskeys that will be tasted discussed talked about uh, in each of the class well i think if they get their book and get started on that and then if they're in new york or coming yep. into new york what a great evening to spend with you and to have one of these great master classes so i'd love to see them well we would too and we look forward to seeing you in a few weeks' time when we have our Burns Night on January Absolutely. 20th. Absolutely. I am quite looking forward to that. Yes, thank you. So we're going to have to uh, speak about the unique whiskeys that we're going to, uh, you're going to bring along for everybody to enjoy, because that's really, you, you, you're you fabulous at sorting that out. Thank you so much for all you do to help us. And, oh, it's my um, pleasure. And for this great book, it really is the ultimate Wonderful. Thank, Thank you, you so much, Camilla. I greatly appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for joining us this week for the Scots in Us Holiday Giving. You can join us on the first and third Monday of the month for the next episode of the Scots in Us. Keep up to date on all that we're doing on AmericanScottishFoundation.com. And so with our best wishes to you and your family from all of us until next time. 